Wow, okay. Who let the dogs out here? Woo! 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 Ever heard of Nail Clippers Lady? Ever heard of it? Is she trying to beat that lady in the Guinness Book of World Records? Cause what is this, boo? You're in the wrong section. You should be heading over to the beauty section and getting yourself a pair of or actually, I lied. Maybe head over to the gardening section and get a chainsaw. Hey, no shoes, no shirt, but I still get service. What? Boy, look at that body. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I think LMFAO wrote this song for this man right here. This guy, literally, no shoes, no shirt, a little tiny speedo, and he's walking around like it's no big deal. It seems like he was swimming or tanning, rolled out of his pool and was like, I need to go get some fertilizer. Popped in his car and went into Walmart looking like that. I wish I had the confidence to do that. That guy has no care in the world. No care in the world, got plenty of beers. Um, excuse me? Her tits are down there. <laughs> wow, wow. They're literally like, anyways, who needs a bra when you're going to Walmart? Who needs one? No, we don't need one. No, no, no. We love them good old saggy tits. Hey everyone, what's up? And welcome back to my channel. It's me, Lindsay Ivan. Hi. Welcome. Today we are looking at some crazy people at Walmart. If you like this and you want to see another part, then let me know in the comments below. While you're down there, smash that like button. Obviously, subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah, let's continue on with the video, folks. Oh. Um. Yeah. I think... They're called undergarments for a reason. Cause you wear them under your garments. At least they look like a clean pair, you know? Is that a shat stain on the back? I actually, I don't know. I shouldn't say that cause I really don't know. I, I don't know what happened here. They're like, fuck, I forgot to put my underwear on. I don't want to have to take off my pants again. Oh well, look, they're still on. They're just, maybe it was opposite day or something, right? Maybe, giving them the benefit of the doubt. Or they were trying to cosplay as a superhero. Superheroes love to do that, right? Superman, they have the red speedo thing over the blue tights. Let me stick it in your butt. Sir, you have a child. Sir, you're wearing that shirt and you're literally holding the hand of a child. You're teaching them all the wrong things, man. Consent to come inside the front door, back door, off limits, bro. Off limits. Shut the back door, Brandy. Not the back door. Not the back door. What? There's doors we don't do. The back door's one of them. I love how it's a candy heart. Let me stick it in your butt. Happy Valentine's Day, boo. Oh no, I feel so bad. I do feel bad for the child. Oh my gosh. Y'all, we have a celebrity sighting at Walmart. Has anyone seen Shrek? I, I, I'm i looking for the ugly stepsister. Oh my God, I love Shrek. Shout out to you. Uh, wow, that's insane. That's literally insane. Sarcasm. A local celebrity at Walmart. See, even if you're wealthy, the rich still shop at Walmart. Save money, live better. <gasps> See, I knew reptilians were real. You ain't fooling me. I see that tail lurking out. I see that tail. You ain't fooling me there. We know they're among us. And they like to shop at, at Walmart. Yeah, look at that. Or maybe it's Barney. I'm hoping it was like Halloween and she just forgot to take off her Barney tail costume. Otherwise, she's a reptilian and they're living among us. <laughs> oh. Oh, I did not need to see that today. Put that on a list of things I did not need to see today. Not only is it a grown man wearing a diaper and a tutu, it's a grown man with a full diaper. That shit is ready, ready to be changed. Now I have seen My Strangest Addictions or whatever. Uh, this is like a kink. Ooh, kinky. <laughs> like where you, you dress up and you pretend to be a baby. I just, I don't know if the whole diaper thing is necessary, but if you are part of that, no kink shaming, and you're, you're you can find fellow people of the same sort at Walmart. <laughs> Won't find it at Costco. No, no. 
Just always Walmart. Target? No. Walmart. Oh, that's another very interesting outfit choice. Okay. We got Queer Santa over here. Okay. I think they're uh, seasonally confused because that's a winter like ski jacket. Also, you have the Christmas hat, but then you're wearing heels and a little mini skirt. It's not Santa Claus. It's Slanta Claus. That was bad, I know. Oh, okay. I am going to give a wild guess. I'm just gonna be wild here for a second, okay? I'm gonna say that this was in Florida. Just throw it out there. I might be wrong, might be wrong. But I have a suspicion that this man is from Florida, the Sunshine State. Is that their slogan? I don't know. Uh, that's a full-on gator. That is a full-on gator. Maybe it's their like emotional support pet or um, body gator, like bodyguard gator. So anyone comes near, like, don't mess with the gates. Okay, so I'm gonna give it to the parent with this one and say that this child is a little troublemaker and likes to run off. So the only way that they will behave is you strap them to a cart, but also I could see the kid going wild and dragging that cart across the store. I'm just getting unruly child and parent that's fed up. The handcuffs were probably a personal one from the nightstand, if you know what I'm saying, but it's whatever works. As long as you remember the key at the end, you're good. We all know those bratty little children. I think we've all experienced them. And you know how they can be. I, I'm definitely not having kids. <laughs> oh my god, Chewbacca, what? Who? Oh my. <sighs> Some people like to express themselves with fashion. It's not a face. Um, maybe I'm just not at that level and I don't understand how high fashion this look is. They got the chains, the grills, lots of rings, and that hair. That's definitely the statement piece. That's what drew me in. Oh, he's digging for treasure in the middle of Walmart. No shame, no shame. He is just, ugh. Ah! That's a sweaty ass crack that your hand is in, sir. Not even like a cute little like cup on the booty or just like a little poof, love you boo. No, full on digging for treasure. Like, did you have a burrito? I want to get a whiff of it. Oh, that's enough. That's enough. All right, folks, that's all for today's video. If you like this video, because this is the first time I've ever done anything like it, then let me know in the comments below and I'll be back with a part two. But if you want it, you gotta let me know in that comments below or else I won't do it. Don't let this video fail, okay? It has potential. And while you're down there commenting, obviously smash that like button and subscribe to my channel. Let's help me get to 10K on this account. Love you. Also, if you don't know, I also have a spooky account where I do spooky stuff. It's also linked in the description. Yeah. I've been your host, Lindsay Ivan. Stick around for some bloopers, because I fuck up a lot, and now, so you wanna say ya. Bye. Literally seems like he was swimming, rolled out of his poo, save money, live better. Is that the slogan for Walmart, or is it like rollbacks every day? Who the fuck cares? Barney is a dinosaur from your imagine I really don't understand. Save money, live better. Cool. Is it actually save money, live better? Save money, live better. It is Walmart. I got it right. Okay. That's just a typical Friday night for Canadian girls going out to the club. You know, the stuff, you gotta look cute. Even if you're freezing sometimes. You're wearing that skirt and dress to go clubbing. Lyle Lyle Crocodile. Cause you wear them under your garments. Also, I just put that together. Wow, the real I'm like realizing things. Right? Or is that a Mandela effect? I think I'm right.